You have a moment? Nice. I'd like to show you how we improved the DaVinci Developer Adaptive in version 2.8. Hello, my name is Harald Brunner, working in the DaVinci Developer Adaptive team. Let's have a look at the new features right away. Renaming and restructuring in a supplied model might cause unresolvable references in an add-on or integration model. The new unresolved references view gives you an easy overview of unresolved references and hence an idea which model parts are no more reachable. A tooltip tells you which part of the reference is still reachable and which not. Here the light control package is still reachable, but not a service interface package. You can go to the resolvable element where the non-resolvable part starts. Looking around shows that the service interfaces package has a new name. Then we can select all similar broken references and adjust the common base path. Broken instance references can be fixed with a dialog that knows them very well. In many cases, the solution is already pre-selected. By the way, the developer adjusts references automatically when you rename elements. Till now, Microsoft model extension parameters can be configured in the DML and come for editors like the executable editor. Additionally, the form views of the generic Odessa model explorer now also show these parameters. An element with extensions defined will have this extra configuration section. Elements can now have comments in the DML. Use the multi-line comment syntax above the element to add a comment. A comment is saved in the description field of a model element. The DML now allows to toggle between hex and decimal format of integers. The toggle control is embedded directly in the DML and your preferences persisted for each integer definition. Last but not least, we've simplified the syntax for references. In the model, each reference is an extra object, and you could see that in the DML. This detail is hidden with the new grammar, making references easier to read and edit. That's it for now. I hope this feature helped to get your work done even quicker. Bye!